It's too much. Yeah, make that piece that you're going to delete. No. <laughs> We're keeping that piece. This doesn't make me make the face. So, how long would you drink this? You said you have a cigar. Yeah, yeah. Take a yeah, yeah, half an hour. hour. Well, what was the cigar? Yeah. And how long would you take for, for a little glass of this? Well, how do you drink it? Well, I drink it like this. You drink quick. That's your way, you know? I'm Scottish. She's already done. <laughs> <laughs> this is extra on Yangon. It's so different than the tequila that we get in the States, you know? And, and people, a lot of the people in America know will tell you that they don't like tequila. Because, yeah. uh, because they drink what they clear about. No, but they're going to know drinking this from mixing. You know why? Because what they clear about is not a hundred percent agave. This is like the ladies' version of tequila. What is it? It's crema de vanilla, so it's like a cream, vanilla cream tequila mix. I've had, uh, yeah, I've had, I've had a bunch of weird ones. I had like coconut and chocolate and uh, mango. And mango. I had scorpion tequila. I have not had scorpion. So JJ, so you've just had a tequila tasting. We did. And we managed to do about so, five oh, bottles. Okay. How five, are you feeling? Five bottles, but not actually five bottles, five shots. Okay, five different One shot from each bottle. <laughs> okay, how are you so, feeling? Surprisingly sober after a tequila. Okay. Uh, have you learned anything new and interesting? I love to do things. I was shocked to find out that we've been taking tequila shots wrong the entire time for our whole lives. In college, you learn. You, know, you lick the salt, you take the shot, and then you bite the lime. You only learn to drink tequila in college? Well, during the yeah. drink tequila, you learn how to fit a 30 pack in a mini fridge. Hey, hey okay. <laughs> the two most important things. And um, what was your favorite tequila today that you tried? Do you know, I don't know. I, I must, I don't know. I, 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 have, I like the. Uh, the añejo and the extra añejo, they're nice. You can you can take your time and sip them, but I don't know. Maybe it's my maybe it's the American way that we learn to drink tequila. But I like a shot of tequila, you know. Yeah. I like the old-fashioned tequila shooter. Blanco, not the best, but I like the process too of taking licking the salt and biting the lime and doing that. So would thing. you do you think you would uh, forfeit a nice uh, reposado añejo? And do the salt thing with it as well, salt and lime, or you I stick know, I feel to like the. It's sacrilegious to take a yeah. shot of extra añejo with salt and lime. I mean, that's a sipping cognac style drink. But I, I think that for me, I like the reposado though. It's still a shot. Ah, yeah. It still has that rapid, I'm going to take a shot at tequila and get drunk kind of feel to it. But it's a little bit nicer flavor, a little bit milder, a little bit more sophisticated than the tequila blanco. Yeah, the tequila. And what, what about that? This fancy one over there, I've forgotten the name of it. Yeah, Hijo Predilito. Yes, it. Muy bien. Yeah, that was lovely. I mean, it's a beautiful flavor, and it, and it smells amazing, too. Gracias a Carlito. Thank you for, for inviting us down here okay. to Tequila Town. For people who want to come check it out, you walk down La Quinta to Avenida Constitución. And you turn right towards the beach, and it's just here on the right hand side. It's a great place, and uh, they'll give you a tequila tasting, and you can buy some good bottles, and have a good time.